All right, Long Leg Legion, today I got a special video for y'all. Today we're gonna be talking about the Guidi 988 Bag Zips. We're gonna be talking about the sizing, the details, and how it fits on feet. All right, so starting off, we're gonna go and we're gonna look at the inside of the shoe. So at the inside of the shoe, you can see, let me focus this a little bit, is that the A988 is the model number and it's gonna be a size 45. Size 45 is also shown at the bottom. So I am a size 11 to 12, depending on the sizing. Uh, some people to recommend size up. I kind of sized, I stayed around true to size. This one has the Vibram fish scale sole, which is included in the box. It's uh, specifically made for Guidi, as you can see the logo, the Guidi. And it does add a little bit of height to the shoe. It isn't much. Little bad boy. The heel is an inch. The sole insert is probably like, what is it? 0.2 of an inch, maybe point, yeah, 0.2 inches. Doesn't really change much of the height. The total height of the shoe is going to be 9.5 inches. Right, here's the, here's the, the shot from the top. You can see back of the foot's right there. You know what I'm saying? I got you guys. Back of the shot's right there. It goes up to around 11 inches. 11 and a half from heel to toe. At its widest, I would say it's around what, one, two, three, four, four and a half inches. Four and a half inches wide. Yeah, I got nothing else to say. So we start off with the details. So it is a horse cordovan leather, which means as a horse from the horse's butt. It's super soft. Uh, most of the time that you see in dress shoes, it will be horse cordovan, but they will be at least finished with a different detail. So it will look shinier and tougher. This one, they just washed it right out. Right when they made the shoe, they uh, tumble wash it. So you can see that it stacks really nice. It's super plush. It's really soft, but also it's super thick. The inside, it's super thick. You can see it's like what? Good couple centimeters, good inch or so thick. The sole is also leather. It's stacked leather and it goes all the way throughout. As you can see through here. There are nails through shown through here, but I just covered up. I don't really care. Some people, they like to get their cobblers to put the nails through, but I think it's just whatever. I don't really care. Zipper says the Guidi. Guidi. So the inside of the shoe is for y'all. I got a good shot. It says Guidi. It's got the nails on the inside. Cool detail. I had to fold the shoe over. As you can see, the leather is super pliable, honestly. Like, it's just whatever. Oddly enough, it's super soft, but it does hold the shape really well. So let's get on the, let's get on some of the details. Lighting's all fucked up from how black the shoe is. Uh, it's pretty much all one piece except for the sole. I think they added something here to make it stiff. So everything else is unstructured really, up until the heel, which has some backing behind it. And also the toe actually, it's super hard here, but up until here, it's super soft. Like, there's like a cutoff right there. Super nice shoe. It stacks really well. It looks better on feet. Um, some other details. It's got a zipper guard to prevent, you know, from zipping the back of your feet or, you know, ca catching your hairs and all that. It's all leather. They'll make the shoe first and then it'll be in its raw form and then, then they'll dye it and wash at the same time. So that's what gives it its unique look. Super soft, it'll give it a shit. It's fucking black. Yeah, there it is. It's super black. Alright, right now we're gonna do it on feet. So put the bad boy down. There's a couple ways to wear them. But uh, put them on first. So you can really see the folds. You can see how it stacks. It stacks really well. Notice that the uh, stacks, they don't really start right here. They pretty much start everything under the stacks. 
and that the hard toe it creases. So here they are from the side, from the back. Notice at the back, the zippers also kind of crease a little, cool little detail. Front, front like that. Now there's a couple ways to wear them. Some people like to wear in the front, kind of leave it down like that. I've been kind of recently doing that. It looks kind of cool. Kind of leave it like that. So it kind of stacks a little. You know what I'm saying? Stack a little in the front. But also shows the back off. Both sides. Other people, they can put it all the way over it. I don't really like this style, but because it kind of hides like the wrinkles a little. It's cool though. But you know, makes my feet look kind of big, so I don't really do that. Here's how the 988Zs look on feet from a different angle. A little further back so y'all can really see how they look on the feet. On the right leg, you can see one style where the, uh, the front of the jean is pulled down. It's kind of hanging on the back of it. The other one, you're gonna see the whole jean over the boot. I don't really wear it like this, but it's to show y'all how it looks like so y'all can determine how you want to look, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, thanks for watching the video.